Hello guys, this is Uncle Bigfish, and today I'll be sharing some stuff that I found out while playing Wuthering Waves with my buddies. And let me tell you this, this one is quite important, so let's get down to it, shall we? The first one I'm going to share is a secret location for a weapon. And not just any weapon, but an extremely good 4-star rarity broadsword. Perfect for banners like Kalcharo, whatever his name was. And to start all that, we first have to go to the Sea of Flames teleportal. And go on from there. Just follow where I go, and I'll lead you straight to it. Once you've arrived, the sword is just right here, free for the taking. Might as well drop down below from this building to fight the Flame Rider just beneath us if you want to. He's a pretty damn good Fire Elemental Echo to have for your Fire Banners. For example, Encore and Chisha. Because you need those for what we're about to do next. Next up is a secret location for a yellow 5-star rarity Fire Elemental Echo. Just follow me and I will lead you straight to the boss.
This fight is going to be quite tough, I'm afraid, as the area glitches quite a fair bit, making it possible for you to suddenly see the bear teleport a short distance towards you and just one-shot you from full health. As you can see, this boss is a level 120 mini-boss, which means that, yeah, he will probably one-tap you. At this point, I guess. A single swing does around 19,000 damage to my rover, so yeah. It's probably not a good idea to face tank any of his attacks. It is possible to dodge everything perfectly while attacking from a melee range. However, the fight is going to take a very long time. About 5 to 10 minutes, depending on your current stats. Making it more likely for you to make mistakes. And if you die from a single attack and have to repeat all this process again from the very start, I think that's no good. So, I'll lead you to him and explain some things that you could do to make the fight easier for yourself. Now, the best answer to this problem is Chisha. I'm sure you all have this redhead, as you get her by default when you first just when, when you were just starting out into the game. Now, level her up and slap a decent weapon on her. Might as well slot that Flame Rider Echo on her for some extra damage and attack stats. Because trust me, you'll need it. Once you're done, go back to the bear and kite him around. Whenever he gets too close, just dodge twice sideways and you'll pretty much miss every single of his attacks. Like I said, this will take some time, but with enough tries, I am sure you'll be able to do it. I hope that you guys enjoyed the stuff that I've shared today on this video, and thank you to Cookie Sparta for these. I wouldn't have found out any of this as quickly as I did, if it weren't for you. Anywho, that's all I got for you guys today. This is your Uncle Big Fish, and I'll see you guys again on the next one. Peace. Over time, always think